everybody, my name is Kyle, and welcome to Metal, Metal Gear Rising. Okay, shut up! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! I've already beaten a couple levels. I have, I've had this game for a while now, but um, I, I've, I have been upgrading with like stuff. I've been getting new weapons, new armor, and stuff like that. I really haven't beat the game yet. I beat it once or twice, something like that. Once or twice. Yeah, once or twice. But I don't know how. One of them scary. Stop. What's your I am reviewing the pre-flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain unit. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Your eyes are, of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned night? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world martial security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PNC, the security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary yeah, right. permission to override their plan. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data. Research! Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. Was a concern? Was? Well, crap, you, Doc. Sending back up. Yeah? Let's pause the video, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm going to just unpause this here. And I'm going to freaking die. Don't fall off. Do not. Do, do not. Thank you. Huh. Which one should I kill first? There's one, two, three, four people so far in my ratings. Oh my god, that's far. How am I supposed to get over there? Huh? What? Ryan? No! 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 Crap, you Courtney! Okay, I'm gonna call, I'm gonna talk to Blade Wolf here. I need to talk to Wolf here. I am setting goal markers on your Soliton radar. Use them to follow me through this area. Hmm. Good boy. I will ignore the condescension and take that as a compliment. You are welcome. Uh, Wolf? You're a one-of-a-kind prototype, right? Correct. I was originally conceived as a weapon to replace humans and cyborgs. Conversation and intelligent decision making were deemed essential to the role. The project was eventually cancelled after three years in development. Why? I have intelligence, but I lack a specific quality essential to any combatant. What's that? Brutality. I am not human, thus I lack the brutality inherent to humanity. Mm -hmm. I was shut down, then revived. Apparently on Sundowner's orders. Sundowner? 
But what's he want with you? Unknown. A manifestation of his sense of humor, perhaps. As a machine, I am more sensitive to my fellow man than an actual fellow man. <laughs> this amused him. The guy has an odd sense of humor. Looks like Desperado brought some sliders. It does indeed. As you know, sliders are more than a single unmanned combat aerial vehicle. They are especially effective when used in tandem with cyborgs. So I hear. Just strap it to your back and you've got yourself a jetpack. In terms of spec, it is equipped with two small engines, turbojet modified from empty ship missiles. These are capable of putting out three kilonewtons of propelling force. Its high aspect ratio wings are built with artificial muscles. Their bending functionality enables both helicopter caliber hovering and a lengthy flight duration when fully deployed. But what about offense? They can't pack much heat. No, for no, no. The sliders were built from the ground up in a network-centric system. As a result, each individual craft has limited combat ability. Toughness was sacrificed for its contact size, which limits its ability to move at high speed or perform high G maneuvers. Flight range and time are strictly limited. Not being a fixed shaped craft, it has little spell functionality. As for weaponry, it is restrained to one of two options, semi-active laser-guided rockets, or a combination of 30 kilogram class unguided bombs and 5.56 millimeter mounted gun pods. But I thought it played a major role in SOP, in regional conflicts and asymmetrical warfare. It did. When all connected in a network mesh, they enjoy extraordinary situational awareness. Mm -hmm. That's a group can search a wide range without missing a single millimeter. Okay, I'm freaking done. We have to freaking do this, bros! Let's do this. Oh, can. Right, I forgot we can. Mr. Can here will help us out. So. A doy. I'll do that. Princess! Oh my god! 